vocab needs to be in your notebooks. I don't care how it gets there tomorrow. Thank you. We tested for calcium. Over here you will see how we tested for calcium. In this one we have a control and in this one we are going to add 20 drops of lake water. Then we are going to add 3 drops of the test ion into it. As you can see there is no change. So that means there is no calcium found in the water. In this test, we will be testing chlorine. This is the control for chlorine. In this one, we're going to add 20 drops of lake water to test. Then when we add the testing solution, There is very little participate, but you could see it a little bit. Here is a close-up so you can see. We're recording here. Be quiet. Chlorine is poisonous to living things. At high amounts, it can cause illness. It can cause chest pain, vomiting, coughing, difficulty breathing, or excess fluid in their lungs. Eventually, it can shut down organ systems and cause cancer. Chlorine test number two. In this tube, we have five milliliters of water. We are going to add this white tablet to see if chlorine is present in the lake water. Put the cap on and wait till it dissolves. The pink shows that there's chlorine traces in the water. As you can see, we tested a positive control and negative control there's lake water and there's tap water. As you can see in the lake water there is no pink like in the chart.